welcome to the project demonstration of eye blink sensor control wheelchair so here we are going to detect the eye blinks with the help of this eye blink sensor so in this sensor we can see eye transmitter and receiver are mounted on these glasses so whenever we close the eye then the transmitter rays from the eye sensor will be received by the eye receiver and it will be given as main input to this amplifier so it will uh, uh, the IC of LM386 and the IC will send the signal to the microcontroller. So the signal is in terms of voltage 0 or 5. Whenever the eye closes, it will provide the 0 volts and eye uh, lid opens, then it will provide the 5 volts. So based on this difference, the microcontroller will start the counter inside the this microcontroller. The counter nothing but it will count the number of blinks per second. So as we are using the timer here, so the timer will count the number of blinks per second and when the start uh, blink, blinking started and that has given an input to the A4 pin of our pic 16 f 72 microcontroller and based on the blinking rate per second the system will control the robots nothing but the wheels of this wheelchair in four di three directions and with the four operations so the three directions are forward left right and the fifth or fourth operation is stop so coming to the blinking rate for example two blinks per second the wheelchair will move forward direction and three blinks left or right so left direction consider and four blinks right direction and next if it is above four blinks the five or six then the wheelchair will stop his movement its movement so nothing but if you blinks randomly fast then it's indicated as we need to stop the wheelchair so for that we are going to providing the power supply from this 12 volt 2 amp battery pack so here we can see so there are two battery packs each battery pack consists of 4 volt 1 amp battery of three numbers are connected in series so we will get 12 volt 1 amp and these two are connected in parallel so we will get high current nothing but 12 volt 2 amp so this is a rechargeable battery from this transformer we can charge a battery so in order to recharge this battery just we need to connect the B to this B slot here and then just give the power supply to this charger so the charger will take the 230 volts inputs and the transformer will uh, convert the 12 volts 230 volts ac to 12 volts ac right now we can see there is a light indication of the battery is charging now so the 12 volts ac given as input to this rectifier section so the rectifier will convert the 12 volts ac to 12 volts pulsating dc and after this there will be a one uh, capacitor so it will provide the 12 volts constant dc voltage which is sufficient to charge our 12 volts battery so once the fully charged so it will depending on the time so now the battery is getting fully charged with minimum of 10 to 12 hours time maximum of 12 hours so after the duration is completed so automatically the power will be blocked with the help of these diodes and you can disconnect the charger right and next so we are going to provide the 12 volts input to this 780 uh, lm l293d l293d is a motor driver which can control the two dc motors in bi-directional so here so we are providing 12 volts input and there will be one 7805 regulator we can see this is the regulator so it will provide the 5 volts constant power supply which is sufficient to our microcontroller start reading input from our eye blink sensor and controlling the robot in wheelchair in directions with the forward uh, left right and stop operation so let us see the demonstration so when we mount the sensor on our head so we should check before execution so whenever we close the eye then another light will on and when we open the eye then it will be off so we should check that before execution the project so let us see demonstration yeah so let us see the demonstration so after mounting the eye blink sensor on your head so check with the lighting indication properly and then switch on this main switch so right now the system part switched on so now it is normal position we can check the light indication when you close the lid also so two blinks so faster blinking Forward. 
dispenser. So let us see the final demonstration. Two legs. Stop. So two legs forward and next. Four blinks again for a moment. Two blinks. Stop. Three blinks. Right, stop. So we should mount the spectacles properly on your hand, on your head, and it should blink. Check the uh, blinking rate from your eye blink sensor. So if it is normally blinking. Normal blinking rates, then you can see that the visor is not moving. So when I am faster blinking for per, per, per second, two blinks stops. Three blinks. Stops. Thank you. Stop the video.